Some of the more than 50 students at Bacchus Marsh Grammar were among those who first raised the alarm earlier this week. Police say the images were sent to someone in the Melton area, which is northwest of Melbourne, on Friday. Investigators have arrested a teenager who has since been released pending further inquiries. Now, the principal of Bacchus Marsh Grammar, Andrew Neal, has labelled the conduct of those responsible appalling. He says it's something that strikes at the heart of students, particularly girls growing up at this age. He believes at least 50 girls in years 9 to 12 have been targeted. The images taken from social media profiles before an AI tool was used to make explicit obscene images. All students are being supported by the school while it works with police to get the images removed and for, to, for those responsible to uh, be taken into custody. Now it, it comes as the Albanese government prepares to introduce new legislation to tackle this very issue. The proposed laws would ban the sharing of deep fake pornography and impose a six-year prison term. Now, if a person also created the deep fakes and also shared it without consent, then that prison term would increase to up to seven years. Now, the new offences will only apply to deep fake material involving adults. Uh, anything involving child abuse material will be covered by existing laws.